We found our favorite all-around boat at the Palm Beach International Boat Show. This custom ocean tank had all the latest in electronics for fishing and cruising and all the amenities that you have at home for you to spend the week on. These boats are so strong and versatile, our government contracts them to be built to protect our waters. Stick around because you're not going to want to miss this one. What's up guys? We are at the Palm Beach International Boat Show and we are looking for the best boat or the one that we think is the best. And um, it's raining, it's wet and cold and windy. And uh, yeah. We walked all around the show and saw many incredible looking boats with so many nice features and styling, like many of the European style boats that have come into the market recently in the last few years. But then we stumbled upon something we've never seen before. <laughs> <laughs> this is life proof, right? Life proof? It is, yeah. And it's all aluminum? All aluminum. Where do you guys make about them? About 8,000 pounds of flotation in the collar system. Nice. So, uh, up in the Pacific Northwest. Nice. And what, um, you know what? I think I saw Alfred Montaner went to your guys, yeah, right? Alfred, Alfred right? Well, <laughs> he did go to the factory, right, and film? He went, so he's been to our factory and to another company that I started called Stay Close International. This is the one that. What, these are, are these, what is it, like so foam fill? Yeah, so they're not foam fill, it's a memory foam. So we own most of the patents on foam stabilized water. Got it. So nice. it's actually a memory pump, so you can take a sledgehammer and get that all day long. That's wow. awesome. How big is this? This is a 35 with a bracket. 35 with a bracket. Ready? Down, sure. Or... Let's go. Okay. So th this is a fishing machine, so, so weekender. This is, we call these Mosser Hummers. Okay. Water Hummer. Uh, because it'll do anything you want it to do, and we make them in different configurations. Everything is custom. So basically, if you can dream it, think it, we'll produce it as long as it does what we want it to do. This is a really cool. I, you know what? The thing is, that being from South Florida, we never get to see these style boats. No, you'll see a lot more of them. Yeah. Yeah. So we're backlogged probably two to three years right now. Mm. So we're just opening up a new 60,000 square foot plant. That's awesome. So this one will do between 65 and 70. And our, our background is high performance drug interdiction boats. So we take all that technology that we utilize for custom border control and we put it into a recreational boat. So they have no idea the capabilities of what this boat will do. Yeah, so it's like uh, overbuilt. Overbuilt. Yeah, overbuilt. Mm -hmm. um, okay, now what sizes do you guys make? So we build from 17 and we can build up to 60. Really? That's crazy. Your wish is our command. The world is your oyster. <laughs> you know, I, I wish there were more of these um, You're gonna see here in a South lot Florida. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy to see that. Yeah, that. yeah. Because they understand what they're for. They're all they're so versatile. Sinkable, so. Yeah. yeah. So what do we have back here? We what's underneath this thing? Yeah. Is this AC? <laughs> so we we have uh, we have AC on this one. Yeah. We have air and heater and everything. I mean, this this is fantastic for this weather down here because you just oh, hang out in here. We've had a blast sitting in, eating lunch, and having yes. a good time. Yeah, so, well, well, we passed see, by the first time. There's like 10, 10 people. Yeah, of course. <laughs> the wind and the rain. There, there were like 10 people right in this thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So and you can cool. see how tippy it is. How you Hello, how, how you doing? doing? Good, good, good. And thank you guys so much. We appreciate it. Sure. And, you know, uh, outside here, a lot of it's just for storage. So, wow. It's pretty much wide open. Oh, my gosh. Everybody needs a, uh, a dustpan. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> mainly just for storage, and we're using the digital switching module for our engine battery controls. Uh, the other side is pretty much storage as well, but we have the fillet table in right now, so it won't up, open up all the way at the moment. Fish boxes on either side, they pump overboard. Um, we can reconfigure these to be whatever people want, you know, so if you don't want benches, we can do like a fishing tackle box, bait well system. Um, we can do flip up benches, you know, if you wanted like a pocketed bench that just kind of flipped up when you wanted to, but this is a real ergonomic bench like this. Um, so these things, have been the most popular. these boats, because they're aluminum, they're fully customizable. Yeah, to anyway, a degree. To a degree, right. It's yeah. not like a mold where you, the molds of these fiberglass boats is it's what you get right? totally yeah, yeah like so. there's a lot of clients will do special little details on them and stuff for them different setups the way they want it yeah and you got this nice yeah uh, the electric sure shade on oh, this one so it's electric it's Ooh. electric we can do it a manual awning as well like with the carbon fiber poles that you've seen other people uh, use around um, and are these uh, like fish boxes storage those are fish boxes for storage yeah okay. yeah this is 
something that people change out on different occasions depending on what they're after. Like some clients want this to be a countertop space for outdoor entertaining. Um, some clients have asked for slider doors, you know. It just kind of depends on that setup and need. This can be set up as a second driving station. Mm -hmm. yeah. So you can have a full second town here if you want to fish from the back deck and operate and drive. We've got a hot water shower over here. And really? then storage. Wow. Um, joystick for piloting you know, come into the dock in the marina. Oh, so you yourself. don't even really need a, a second helm. You could have you yeah, can pilot so from out here. Yeah, we just have the joystick the back okay. here for a second helm. Nice. And, uh, and you got a camera system up here? Yeah, rear deck camera. Mm. Uh, we've also got a FLIR camera on the top. So we've got that spun around. So if you look at our Garmin displays, oh, yeah. you'll see we've got two cameras up there. One is the FLIR and one is the, the rear deck camera, the GC200. And so. this thing's really nice. You got a nice breeze coming. Yeah. Nice. yeah. That's really cool. Yeah, we want to make it stout enough that you can leave it open while you're underway. Okay. And then uh, this cabin, this this is our standard 35 foot cabin model. So we have a few different 35 foot variants. Uh, this one, the table drops down to make a sleeping arrangement up here for, for uh, guests. And then this chair can rotate around. There, there's suspension modules. This is a suspension module on this one, where this is the bulkhead style suspension module that floats. This thing looks nuts. And this one has the drop <laughs> pan feature so you can, wow. you can sit in it when you want or you can pull the handle and you can fold it down. It, you know, because everybody likes to drive standing at times, right? It's yeah. kind of an important part of the uh, project. And you have a fridge here with a freezer? Yeah, right? you can choose fridge, 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 freezer. That's up to the client. I mean, there's tons of space in here. Um, big sink, lots of cabinetry, lots of storage. Kind of like a whole DC panel system over here. Uh, height adjustable footrests. You know, obviously everything kind of moves and ergonomic. We got the throttles and yeah, the that's, armrest. That's wild. So when you are running your cleat out the window, you can push that over, run your cleat, use your joystick system, use your bow thruster, not worry about the throttles, um, which is a nice feature for a lot of clients. Amazing. It also helps when you're in rough water because now this is moving with you in the chair all together. You're no longer moving independent, so you're moving fluid with it. Um, we've got um, new wire marine switches. we got a lot of wireless phone chargers. Everybody's got wireless phone chargers these days, high in stereo. This has a boiler system on board for producing hot water and also producing heat. The boat's going to go up to Michigan. Um, so he needs both AC and, uh, you know, heat. So um, he'll get that up in Michigan with the systems on board. Nice. So we have a full stand-up uh, bathroom down here with a shower. Um, the bunks down below, they convert to one big sleeper. Okay. So the backrest cushions become filler panels to make a big sleeper. But we like to walk through our vessel as opposed to walk around it. Mm -hmm. It's just a safer way to do it. Yeah. Uh, it also allows us to open up and leave the door and the hatch open on hot days on the inner coast. Yep, yep, yep. You yep. just get this breeze, right, that just comes through the boat. Um, yeah, that's so that's so funny because like every boat that we've been on, you walk on the outside. Right. Yeah. And we like the, the center. Yeah, and <laughs> I mean at night, you know, you can, you know, slip, fall off, and all that. Yeah. So that's that's a different concept, different idea. I, well, I actually like beach, that. We, we talk about beaching our boats a lot, right? Mm -hmm. So this has a bow door that's folded down right now. You could drive up on any sandbar, even on a rocky beach. It doesn't matter. It's aluminum. We are a half-inch thick solid aluminum wow. uh, down at the keel. Um, we have a double reinforced plate over the whole bottom of the boat to protect the boat when you come up into the beach. It's not like a boat you have to worry about. You just go use it. And the bow door folds down. You've got a ladder up there. It's easy to get on and off. Like. That's awesome. Uh, makes it simple and easy. Can we go down there? Absolutely, okay. yeah, awesome. please do, yeah. Sweet. You'll see a lot of <clears throat> cabinetry and storage. So you have, you can use this as like a kitchenette and then this? Yeah, a lot of clients will have a second sink down there maybe, so they come out of the bathroom. A microwave know, here. But you can also use the food prep station. Nice, um, and this is storage down here? Yeah, all storage. storage. And this is your head? That's the head, yeah. Let's take a look in there. Well, that's big. I can stand up in there, no problem. Yeah, like, yeah. let me see. Yeah. You could? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Absolutely. Nice. Sweet. Yeah. Awesome. Well, there's a lot of space down here, too. So this, this converts into one big berth? Yeah, wow. lots of space. You know, high-end upholstery. 
Yeah, I love this. I think this is this is awesome. It's a great means of egress. You're not climbing through a porthole or something. That's right. Yeah, this is really nice. So turn those dogs vertically. Yep. And okay. then and then this one. Yeah. Out. Now the hatch above your head there. See okay. the dogs on the corners. Yep. Turn those ninety. Yep. Open the door and then push up on that hatch and push up. Yep. There you go. Look at that. So you come right out. Huh. You're gonna. The door's gonna catch and hold itself open. Yep. Yep. Nice. Look at that. And then you've got a drum windlass up there. So um, we're picking the drum windlass. So you'll have the drum on this, and then we have the ultramarine anchor with the ultramarine anchor shackle. Got so it, it always self writes up into the chute. Um, we give clients a wireless controller as well, so they can operate that windlass from anywhere on the boat. That's awesome. Yeah, you that's literally so cool. have nothing. You just up, down, up, down. That's it. Wow. Huh. That's so neat. The TV above the fridge, you can move that down to the sleeper. You can also move it on the back deck. Really? Right? So that, you know, it's a pretty full AV system on board. Um, this is this is a. I've never seen a boat like this before. Yeah. This is yeah, and, it's and we just, have them all the way up to about. We're, we're, we built a 50 footer last year for a client. We've done some 46s. Yeah. We can do inboard diesel, water jet boats. We've kind of done a lot of unique things. We've done a couple of diesel outboard boats. We did one of these as a big yacht tender with twin inboard diesel stern drives for a client, right? So um, the package and the idea can be manipulated to make the right uh, mission. And the right? general and the gentleman said yeah. you guys do from 17 up. Yeah, right? 17 to 50. Wow. wow. Those are our those are our size yeah. ranges. Awesome. So wow. yeah. well thank you very much. Yeah it's a thank pleasure you so to meet much. you. I yeah, liked you it. Yeah. Yeah Micah. Thank you so much. Guys check them out. Oh life proof boats. Life proof boats. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Life proof boats. Thank you, thank you.